friends, hey, it's your girl Kitty. If you are new to my channel, welcome. If you are a ride or die, part of KKC, welcome back. Hi, John. Hi. Come here. If you are not part of the KKC family and you would like to be, it's simple. All you need to do is sprinkles and smiles, drop the sprinkles and smiles. If you don't know what sprinkles and smiles means, I will leave a huge hint at the end of this video. So stay tuned, check out my content, and if it feels um, like something you would enjoy, um, we would love to have you join the KKC family. Today, guys, I am having Greco. Greco Pizza. It's a uh, pizza company here in the city where I live. I'm not sure how far across Canada Greco goes, but yeah, it's, as far as I know, it's just local East Coast maybe. I'm not sure. So, I'm gonna show you guys these before I give. Ooh, go fingers. Go. Get Oreo. <sighs> All right, my friends. Yes. We're having Greg go. We're having Greg go. I don't know what's going on with my computer. It's being silly. So that was like a really messy intro, but whatever. Um, <clears throat> yeah, so I have some donair sauce to dip the garlic fingers in. They didn't really cut this very well. Cheesy, yummy goodness. Get some donair sauce on there. Would you like a bite? Yum. I don't have a napkin either. Let's get in this little donair. Yum. It's in a pita bread, donair meat. Onions and very little tomato because tomato is not my friend. <clears throat> Yum. Mmm. John got just a little personal six inch pizza. And Jamie got a calzone. That is huge. And it was like seven dollars. It's huge. It's like this big around. It's like a And got some Pepsi.
I love their little donairs, but I love their garlic fingers. They're my favorite. Yum. So like I said in the last couple of videos, I want to do a Q&A video, so if you have any questions, drop them down below. That onion's going to fall. You can get, it was upside down, you can get quarter pound donair, half pound, or three quarter pound. Yummy. This is spicy. Donair meat is spicy. So if you don't like spicy food, you won't like donair meat. Mmm. There's even been, I haven't had Greco in a while. There's even times I'll just, just garlic fingers with bacon on it. I was hungry. So, crazy story. <clears throat> I haven't heard too much about this story, just the gist of the story. Um, I'm not even sure where it happened. I, my mom was telling me. In a parking lot somewhere, there was a car. Um, there was like a big mountain of snow. Like, because they cleared the, like, plowed the parking lot. And they just pushed all the snow. And somehow, this lady got buried in her car. So she was like inside her car, inside the snow bank. Like a huge mountain of snow. And the plow came through plowing and going to push some more snow back. Uh -oh. 
There you go, Jaleel. <laughs> um, <clears throat> going to push the snow back and he like bumped her car and was like, what must have been like, oh, whoa. And I'm assuming, you know, he got out to check it out, realized there was a car underneath all that snow. So they probably tried to like clear the snow from around the car. This isn't this part. I'm assuming guys, you know, they probably cleared the snow to tow the car you know, tow truck company to come. Anyways, yeah, there was a 48 year old, I think she was 48 years old woman inside the car. Oh, she was alive, but I, I haven't heard how long she was there. This is hard to drink from, so I have to like basically just like pour the water in my mouth. Pour the water in my mouth and then swallow. Mm hmm I have to do that. Let my mouth fill up with water and then swallow it. Because it's so awkward to drink from. Anyways, but oh my god. Can you imagine? Mm-mm. <sighs> I want it. <sighs> oh, another thing that um did did you guys watch the Netflix series Making a Murderer? I've been following this case for a while. And uh, he he won his appeal, Stephen Avery. Uh, Excuse me. Okay, this is interesting. I'm just reading through Google some news just to talk about something. It says, rare new kind of twins, boy and girl, are semi-identical. Doctors in Australia say they have identified a second case of twins appearing semi-identical. Interesting. I was trying to see if there was anything in the news about lady trapped in car covered in snow. Okay, okay, I found it. California. What? California snowplow hits car buried in snow. Driver discovers woman. Oh my god. <laughs> California snowplow. Hits car buried in snow. Driver discovers woman trapped inside. Oh my god. They legit shovel the snow from around her driver's side door and open it and she just climbs out like oh my gosh 
It says an unidentified 48-year-old woman was found safe inside the car. A California woman trapped for hours in the vehicle by mounds of snow was found unharmed after a snowplow struck her buried car. A South Lake Tahoe, California snowplow operator was making his rounds on February 17th when he unexpectedly hit something buried in the snow. Oh my gosh. Like, that would be so... Traumatic. Talk about PTSD be it oh my god, buried alive. By the sounds of it, it was only a matter of hours though. But still. <clears throat> I find the very end of this really messy. No, give me those onions. Yes, I'm licking the tinfoil. <clears throat> so, I just got home a little bit ski ago. Had to go pick up John. Whew, I just gotta chill. Had to go pick up Johnny at my mom's. And then we took my oldest nephew some my mom made homemade cookies and made him a big container of homemade cookies so took him some cookies so went to see my sister and drop off cookies to her son well they're not just for him he'll share but and then my sister I was like, what are you up to? She's like, said she was going to walk to the liquor store. So we gave her a drive. And then brought her back home. And then we took John and got him a haircut. I was like, oh, there's my boy. He was hiding under a big helmet of hair. <laughs> It's what it looked like. The way his hair grows and shapes, it looks like he's wearing a helmet. <laughs> and <clears throat> I booked a nail appointment, so these are looking a little crappy. So I booked my nail appointment for Wednesday, so I just got a few more days to put up with these. I have to go. Um... I have to go online and look at some ideas. And she's just looking for something to get into. Get a hairball? Get a hairball? My tummy's making noises. Mm. So after John got his hair cut, then we went to like, where we took him to get his hair cut is in like a little strip mall where it's like little businesses all like in one little strip mall. 
it's not like you can't go in. It's not like a mall you go in and walk around to stores. It's just, you know, I'm sure you guys know what a strip mall is. Anyways, so we come out of the hair salon where he got his hair cut and like just walked like two or three doors down and it's the pizza place. So we went, went in and ordered our food and had to wait like 20 minutes for them to make it. And uh, so I just installed a game on my phone. They had we, um, <laughs> I almost said we, we fi. <laughs> they had, I went to say free Wi Fi. I almost said we fi. They have free Wi Fi. So I turned the free Wi Fi on, and John, I installed a game for him to play so he wouldn't be bored. For some reason, my data isn't working. I'm a little perturbed. Like, why isn't it working? I don't get it. I can't believe they didn't give any napkins. Like, really? Wanna bite, friends? So, <clears throat> this is my cheat meal for the week. Yep. I don't really classify Subway as a cheat meal. I, I had Subway yesterday and did a Subway video, so... But you'll already know that because you're going to see it first. <laughs> so, yes. <clears throat> and they got a cute little jingle that goes with their, their commercial. It goes, 310, 30, 30, Greco, 310, 30, 30, woo! Hashtag not sponsored. <laughs> I just like it. It's super. That's how I remembered their number. Anytime I was drunk and wanted, like, because everyone knows night of drinking, you want greasy something when you're done. Drop the black heart emoji if you want greasy food after a night of drinking. But... <clears throat> I'm gonna move this down. That's normally my shirt says rebel. Rebel. That's normally uh, excuse me. That's normally what my go-to after a night of drinking. Like when I'm done drinking for the night. I want pizza or a greasy burger or something like that. Or donair. Putin. They have like the little, the little, the little, uh, food, food stands. It's like a truck, like a food truck where they make like sausage dogs and, um, I'll, I'll show you. We'll, we'll do a, an adventure out this summer. Um, 
yeah, an adventure out. And I will show you what I mean. I'm sure you guys know what a freaking food truck is. <laughs> but anyways, they're usually parked across the street from the bars in the summertime. Actually, are they there in the winter too? I can't remember. Um, yeah, yeah, because I've got Putin before. But anyways, yeah, so we'll definitely do some adventures when the nicer weather comes, guys, for sure. I'll vlog some awesome stuff. And because it's been a while since Kitty has been to the bar for a good time. And my, cer my I can't talk, my 36th, my 36th birthday is coming. And yeah, I want to, I want to do something. Or, I don't know, I guess I don't need my birthday to go out, but. <clears throat> mm. Mm. Mm -mm. Damn it. Whatever. I got laundry to do anyway. Well, this is a hot mess. All right. Have a, have a sip of Is Pep. Good old Pepsi. Oh, prr. Anyways, okay. Thank you for having dinner with me, guys. I love you so much. You guys are amazing and wonderful and beautiful. And if you're ever feeling down and sad, just think of me and know that I love you. I adore you. You are special to me. I enjoyed having dinner. I enjoyed our random conversations about this, that, and everything because that is just how we roll over here. And... I will catch you guys in my next video if you've made it this far. <clears throat> You're amazing and I appreciate that you watch my video to the end. And if you are watching my content for the first time, um, I hope you enjoy my videos and I would be honored to have you part of my KKC family, Kit Kat Crew. That's what KKC stands for. Um, but yeah, I heart you guys so much and I will see you in my next video. Deuces. <laughs>